If you're looking to set up a CO2 system, you may have realized it can be a little bit intimidating and also a little expensive. But don't worry, I've got a simple recipe for CO2 and I've got a simple system that you can set up in about 5 minutes. Uh, the system should also cost you no more than $5, so let's jump right into it, our DIY CO2 setup tutorial. And this is what we'll need. An empty soda bottle, an airline adapter, about a foot of airline, and of course the diffuser itself. As far as the CO2 recipe, we'll need sugar, water, yeast, and baking soda. We'll start off with the easiest step, rinse your bottle. Step 2, connect one side of the airline tubing to your bottle and the other to the diffuser. And you have literally done the hardest parts of this tutorial. Now we're going to mix it up. Go ahead and mix the yeast, sugar, water and baking soda into the bottle and it doesn't matter what order you put them in. Do keep in mind that this recipe uh, isn't set in stone. Feel free to add a little bit more yeast, add a little bit more sugar, see what works best for you. The one thing that is important is to shake the bottle well. Make sure that there's no sugar collected at the bottom and I would shake it for about 10 seconds. And right here, I'll just reconnect the airline tubing. This next step is completely optional. I got a free airline check valve, so I decided what the heck, I'll throw it in there. If you don't have one, don't worry about it. Step four, and the last step for that matter, is to place your diffuser near the bottom of the aquarium. And that's it. I wait about two to four hours for the CO2 to pressurize after that, you'll notice a gradual increase in bubbles. There are definitely more complicated and more efficient CO2 diffusers out there, but for the cost and for the uh, practicality, this is by far the easiest and the one I highly recommend for you guys to try out. Um, I got most of the uh, materials from here uh, from the Wish app. Highly recommend that the CO2 diffuser was three bucks, the airline tubing was like 25 cents, and the airline adapter was one dollar. So with that said, I hope this helps. Please let me know if you have any questions. My name is Gus, and this is my aquarium info. Thanks for watching.